Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. In this episode, I'll be testing out the Mavic Mini flight time in a real life environment. A lot of the time we get asked, how long does the Mavic Mini actually last? Like in real life, how long does it really last? When it's not in a controlled environment, when it's not in a controlled environment where the, the aerospace is completely stable. So in this video, I'm gonna be running down three batteries that we have for the Mavic Mini and then averaging out those batteries um, not scientific by any means whatsoever, but we're going to average out the flight time for those three batteries and then see what the average flight time is in a real life environment. I hope that has made sense, but let's give it a go. So here we have our arsenal of products for this today. We have got the Mavic Mini, the controller and the three batteries we'll be running down in this test. What's pretty insane is that the Mavic Mini is smaller than the controller you use to pilot it. And I found out today that my phone is even bigger than the Mavic Mini, which is just ridiculous. Like, you could, you may as well just fit this in your pocket instead. Do a couple calls on this. <laughs> Call your mum. Hi mum, I'm here. Yeah. Text your, girl. Text your, text your girlfriend. Text your girl. Put a bit of paper on it and there you go, Mavic Mini is your new phone. First of all, I linked up all the equipment together. I made sure that the remote control had full battery and I was ready to go. I then did a quick pre-flight test, making sure that the entire aircraft is safe and ready for flight. Here's our first battery ready to go and I have started the stopwatch. The first flight went perfectly fine and we lasted 29 minutes and 82 seconds in the air before the battery ran out. I wasn't going to play the entire 30 minute video for you guys so I've condensed them into really quick clips. I then changed the battery to the second one and took it for a flight again. This time the battery lasted slightly longer which was 30 minutes and 12 seconds. And finally, I took the third battery out and it lasted 29 minutes and 11 seconds. Overall, the flights went really well and I was very impressed with the Mavic Mini's flight time as it was. There was a small deviation in the flight times just by a couple of milliseconds or seconds and it stayed true to its word. However, I thought I'd go back to the science lab, aka my bedroom, to check out the final numbers. We've conducted the three experiments on the battery and we are now going to go back to the science lab and check out the results. So really simply here, we got the three results. We added them all together and then we divided them by three. This is how you get your average. After this, it will give us the average time you'd be expected to fly in the air. As there was only three tests and three results, this won't be the most generalizable study out there. So. I would definitely suggest doing this study for yourself and including more results. I should do science more often. The new calculations that we have just figured out right now in the science lab is that the Mavic Mini approximately lasts 29 minutes and 68 seconds in the air. Have an amazing time out there with the 29 minutes and 68 seconds that the Mavic Mini affords you. Good luck pilots. <laughs>